This story is not one of my finest moments, but I want to share it with you guys anyways. Hey guys, Asher back here with another video and this time I want to share a story with you guys. Um, this story goes back to when I was at McMaster University, so this was maybe like 6-7 years ago. And uh, my friends and I wanted to try something different. We got an advertisement for a comedy show that was taking place at the university. There were a few comedians that were going to come around. So we bought some tickets and we went to the show. And when I was at the show, there was this one guy. He was, um, he was an African man from Uganda and uh, he was kind of a big black guy like me and so he kind of had a little bit of an accent and the jokes that he was making were very very funny people in canada should have the easiest immigration policy do you want to move to canada okay we'll come pick you up it doesn't matter and i was connecting to him you know so during the show um you know he was only on for like maybe like five minutes or so and he was much much funnier than the other comedians that were on stage everybody was having a blast listening to this guy um especially his accent too his accent was, was pretty funny um anyways so the show goes on and i wasn't drunk or anything i had like a beer or two and he was cracking jokes like um one time he went to um have dinner with some of his white friends and you know, he was eating his food and they were saying like, oh, you don't like your food because it looked like he didn't really enjoy what he was eating. And then he was like, yeah, I don't really like it. And then apparently his white friends were like, oh, maybe you'd like it a little more if there was flies around your food. So like he was making those kind of like, you know, African jokes. And um, I was laughing a lot. And um, later on in the show, he said something about like uh, that black guys don't um, perform certain things in bed. Like they don't. You know what I mean? Um, so <laughs> I thought that was funny when he said that as well. Later on as the show goes, he ends up saying something like, oh yeah, like, you know, one time I went on a date with this one girl, one time I was with this one girl. And then immediately in my mind, I was in the crowd of like maybe like 30, 40 people. Like, I ended up just saying to him like, did you go down on her? <laughs> I could have screamed it in the crowd. Um, and everybody started laughing and so at the time his reaction was kind of like oh like I'll tell the jokes here blah 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 and stuff and he was kind of offended by my statement um, which I found a little odd because I was just like oh like I, I didn't say that to like steal your thunder or whatever like I genuinely was just laughing and I couldn't hold myself because I was having such a good time and I ended up saying the first thing that came to my mind out of excitement but he ended up saying like oh like i'll let it slide it's not like he roasted me for being in the crowd but i think he was a little upset by that comment which i haven't really seen comedians do that before but hey it is what it is it was a learning experience um but yeah i really wanted to share this story with you guys because i was just happy to be on youtube browsing and listening to some comedians and then i was like oh yeah i remember that one comedian that like when I went to the show, like he kind of got mad at me for <laughs> saying something during his performance because the way the show ended, like his last joke actually wasn't as funny. So I don't know if like I ruined his flow or whatever, but um, yeah, he seems to be doing pretty well so far. Like I was just watching some of his videos on YouTube and he seems to be on the big, big YouTube channels for comedy and stuff. So it seems like he's been growing over the last few years. So <laughs> wish him all the luck in the world. And I apologize if you ever see this video for me um, saying something during your show. But anyways, guys, a nice simple video, a nice story time for you guys. You can check out his videos. Maybe you think he's funny, maybe you won't. But um, yeah, that was a, a fun experience. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.